Today, Louisianians were updated on the effort to fight COVID-19 at a rare bipartisan joint press conference with Governor John Bell Edwards and House Minority Whip Steve Scalise. They focused on the coronavirus and what could be done to restart the economy here in Louisiana. And Karen Swenson has that story for us tonight. Well, the governor is looking at the data and some of it is encouraging. We are flattening the curve. And while he says it's not time to let up yet, it is time, at least behind the scenes, to start talking about reopening the economy. Governor John Bell Edwards and Republican Whip Steve Scalise, along with governors from across the country, are now talking with President Trump about how to begin that process and when. For starters, the governor says Louisiana will create a task force called Resilient Louisiana, made up of 18 leaders from private and public sectors who will help formulate a plan. They'll look especially closely at energy and manufacturing, health care, tourism and education. They'll address health care disparities in communities and job training for displaced workers. And I know there's a significant concern that if we remove too many restrictions all at once that we're going to see the cases spike. That's a concern that I have as well. So we have to try to strike the right balance between promoting uh, public health and minimizing the, the, the spread of COVID-19. And let's keep in mind, when we talk about reopening the economy, uh, we're not talking about picking a choice between safety and economic recovery. You can do both and we have to do both. And that state task force is comprised of all sorts of different people, bankers and state lawmakers and civic and business leaders and people from the healthcare industry and restaurateurs, you name it. Also, there is going to be a federal task force as well, and President Trump has tapped Senator Kennedy to be a member of that. Back to you. All right, as Karen just mentioned, Congressman Scalise and Senators Cassidy and Kennedy will all be part of the president's national task force to reopen the economy.